Welcome back to the show. Talked about the Folk Music Showcase earlier on in the show mm -hmm. with Kim. Well, one of the bands that are going to be performing and a part of that fabulous showcase is Hooraya Band. We are joined by Alex and Cynthia. Welcome to the show. It's great to have you guys here. Thank you. It's been a while. It has. How long has it been since you last appeared, Alex? Maybe yeah. two years. No, wow. a little less. But well, yeah. let's catch up. Let's let's talk a little bit about uh, the background of the band. Tell us a little bit about how you guys uh, were formed. Sure. Um, well, I'm a singer-songwriter, and I, I did a lot of performing on my own for a few years, and mm -hmm. then uh, met my friend Mike, who's still the drummer, the only original member from the mm -hmm. beginning. And, okay. And yeah, it just kind of grew from there. Went from three members to five members and started playing a lot out of town recently. And yeah, it's been good. So two of the five are here. How did you guys connect? Well, we've been to we've gone to Carlton since 2013, uh -huh. and now we're both in fourth year. And I just joined Hooray Band. I joined kind of third year a bit, and now this year, like since the summer, since the beginning of the summer, I've been like kind of a main member. And Excellent. yeah, how have you enjoyed so, the experience of working with everyone? It is great. Well, we all love each other. Okay, <laughs> I was going to say it's a good thing. She's no. adjusting the answer already. <laughs> <laughs> no, we all really like working with each other. I love working with them. It's so much fun. And mm -hmm. so that's like a main, I think, asset you have to have in being a, in a band. You have to like the musicians and really enjoy the time together other than the music. Right. And so. Yeah. And in rehearsals, your voices totally jive together, yeah. which is yeah. which is that's a that's important. Yeah, that's yeah. important. It's a good factor. <laughs> that's a good thing. Yeah. Alex, how would you describe your sound to, to people? Because I know you you really you don't have one particular sound. You, yeah. you actually have a lot of different genres that you delve into. Yeah, I don't know. I I try to say uh, that we're we're kind of like a fusion of pop, uh, soul, and like folk. Mm -hmm. Um, but especially recently with the with the fifth member we're kind of straying from the folk and getting more into like soul and funk and nice. but we're really true to like we're, we're pop band you know uh -huh. yeah um but yeah it's been kind of like evolving recently and we're getting a little more dancey uh the new record we just finished recording is much more influenced from like soul and yeah it should be awesome that's awesome is that your first record or no uh nope. second second ep second. they're both eps okay yeah. Trying to so what do you write about in the in the latest album what do I write about? Yeah. Uh, it's more like, I mean, it depends. All of my songs are kind of personal stories, usually. Mm -hmm. um, but this this album's a little more, it's, I don't know. It's <laughs> like, they're love stories, but they're a little more like dancey. Right. Like even the lyrics, like. Life. Yeah. Life, life stories. Life you write stories. about what you're going through, yeah. and then yeah. you, you make It's funny, it a lot of, like, a teacher of mine at school who's a songwriter asked me, he's like, are all your songs about stuff happens to you? And I'm like, yeah. He's like, he's like I can't write about myself. <laughs> I'm like, oh, really? He's like, I can't write anything that's not. Who's your teacher? Uh, Frank McKinley. Oh, He's okay. A, yeah. But that's what makes it so, that's when people connect to you is when you write about yourself or what you're going through. It I just so. makes it, oh, that's what well, I connect Well, with. that and things that are happening around the world, there's right. a lot of, you know, social things that, that mm -hmm. get yeah, involved just in find music as well. It's easy to write from your perspective. Do you write on your own? I'm just wondering the collaborative process within a band. Do you write and they're like, can we change it this yeah, way? Yeah, yeah. We're, we're very collaborative. Like, I'm the, I'm the primary songwriter. I usually come with songs. Um, but everyone comes from different backgrounds. Uh, we're all great. We give our own, our own input and the songs mm -hmm. grow. The songs change a lot once I bring them to the band, for sure. Um, how long have you been involved with Fulcrum? Um, pretty recently, I got contacted by Kim, um, but I've, I met him probably a year and a half ago. Uh, he's he's been a judge at different showcases I've been at. Oh, um, yeah. yeah, and he contacted me pretty recently, maybe two three weeks, asking me to play at the showcase, and I'm I'm ecstatic. Yeah, uh, what do you awesome. think of the concept? I think it's awesome. About. It's really cool. Um, Ottawa really needs that kind of like um, a venue that's um, you know that. You can you can do different stuff in right. It's not like a club. It's yeah. not a cafe. Mm -hmm. um, you can have all sorts of different shows going on. And yeah, Ottawa doesn't really have that. We have lots of small clubs. We have a few big theaters, but we don't have that middle ground of like a community arts area that, that you, you can do anything in a versatile place. That's awesome. Yeah, I'm looking yeah. forward to seeing the growth yeah. of this. I think it's an yeah. amazing. And I'm really excited initiative. to play. I mean, it's excited to see it. Excited to play with the Split, one yeah. of my favorite bands. And uh, yeah, I've seen them a bunch of times. I'm excited to actually share the stage. You're going to yeah, perform awesome. for us here today on the show. Right. What song are you going to sing? Uh, we're going to play Damage, okay. uh, which is off the new EP. Uh, it's probably the least dancey of the, of the five <laughs> tracks, but... You know, there's only two of us, yeah. so we do but what we can do. But still catchy, catchy nonetheless. There's a really catchy. nice part in there. And the new album, ex Expectation for Release Date? April 28th is the is You the got plan. it down. Yeah. April 28th, 2016. Well, That's we'll right. step aside, guys. Thanks cool. so much Thank for you. being here. Thank you. This is the moment. This is the time. This is where you run or where you choose to climb. This is your mother, and you're her son. And you will trust her up until your days are done. Every step, every breath, 
Making the most of it, yeah. Cause it's all you got. Hoping you won't regret. Oh, I know there are many roads we could go down. But I want to stay on mine. I don't have time to waste. But when we collide, I lose my breath and fall back again. Which damage is worse? This must be your curse. I'm thankful then. felt this before, grasping for air as I hit the floor, and your vessel is cracked and it's bent, along with it, the money that you spent, every step, every breath, making the most of it, yeah, cause it's all you got, hoping you won't regret. is worse. This must be your curse. I'm thankful then. It'll be a long, long time till I go back there again. But I'll be fine. Must be your curse. I'm thankful then. Your damage is worse. This must be your curse. I'm thankful then. I'm thankful then.